Okay guys, it's DJ Holmes coming to you with a pickup video or well, recent pickups. I know I've been going for a couple of months, but this is what I've picked up. I have 11 pair of shoes and a couple of things for supplies. First off, we have the St. Vincent St. Mary Ones. Got these for 80 at MSX. Midwest Sneaker Exchange. DS for 80. How could you beat that? There will be a review for all these shoes. I just want to show you guys what I picked up. Like you're on the tongue. Yep, no OG box sadly, but still clean still got stars as you can see yep same as same Mary ones we got the Dornbecker free run 5.0 just want to show you guys a quick look like I said this is just what I picked up got these for 80 local Facebook group there you go they're going for 150 on eBay so 80 was a steal to me very comfortable shoe fit like a sock true to size like the translucent laces, purple at the bottom that fade up to green, slash blue. There you go, Dornbreaker Free Run. It's a fly knit chucka from Nike. Most comfortable shoe I ever put my foot in. There will be a review for all these shoes, as you can see. Very stable, good running shoe. I work in these shoes, actually. Did work out in them before. Very good shoe. There you go. On feet and review coming soon. Next, we have the Nike SB Dunk Low Pro. The Dorothy colorway. Off the Wizard of Oz theme. Got these for 45 bucks. Local Facebook group. How could you beat that? There you go. Super clean. DS, $45. For you coming soon. My next pickups are Jordans. I'm not a hype beast, just like Jordans. So right here we have the Carolina Two Lows from 04. Did get these for free, thanks to local Facebook group. Do need a restoration. I am gonna restore these. Just don't know if I'm gonna do a video on it or not. Yeah, these are from 04, so I was 11 and a half. I wear 12 through 13, so I had to take the intel out for these. Gem man is still inside, but don't have the insole on me right now. Got to repaint. Ice up the yellowing. Clean the laces. Yeah, full restoration. I just don't know if I'm doing a video. I will got you. I will let you guys know. So stay tuned. Jordan ones, the mellows from the PE series that Jordan Brand did. They wear these a couple times. Great quality, great new buck. That gold is just, just amazing. A little creasing on the toe box, nothing major. Jordans are going to crease. All shoes crease if you wear them. There you go, 30 bottoms. Just wanted to show you guys what they look like. Review and on feet coming soon. Stay tuned. Up next, we have the remastered Oreo 4s. These released in 1999 before us. You guys may know. Pick these up. Traded Bread Fours for DS Oreo Fours and DS Mellow Ones. That was a fair trade if you ask me. There you go. Bread Fours were not DS. There you go. All leather. Quality is excellent in my opinion. Yep. Got the Jordan 1 Duevu, or however you pronounce it. This is all premium leather. Like the recent SBs that recently released. Premium leather. Suede inside. They actually have a serial number on them, if you can see that. There's the tongue. All suede on the back. All suede inside. Leather insole. Yeah, so these are Jordan 1 Nuevo from the pack. It did come out in burgundy and another color, I believe. Icy bottoms. Reviewing on feet comes soon. Next, we have the Jordan 1330 breads or gym reds, whatever you want to call them. Did get these on release day when they released. Warm a lot. Didn't really crease on me. Still in great condition. These are like one of my top five shoes in my collection one of my best 13s in my collection 
Yeah, they barely creased on me, so they only creased a little bit right there. That's nothing. There you guys go. Review when IP comes soon. Here, that's how you know we're going for a long time. The, I did get these on release day at Black Friday. These are the 2014 infrared 6s with the 3M right there. Review and Afi coming soon. I just wanted to show you guys. Don't have the light socks on me right now. Don't know where they are. Gotta go find them. Wear your kicks, guys. Wear your kicks. There you go. Jordan 6. Last but not least, had to say my favorite shoe for last. These are the KD7 Ump Pearls. You guys go as you know. KD made these in commemoration of his um, pro passed away from breast cancer. As you can see, the breast cancer sign on the back. Just want to give you guys a quick glimpse of these. Review and Afi coming soon. Last shoe pickup. Not really supplies, but did get these Yeezy tips, lace tips from Roots, located in Milwaukee. Shout out to them. Got these for $15. Haven't decided what shoe I'm gonna put them on, but it will be fire when I put them on there. Next, I got a metal fire file from Home Depot just to get paint off of midsoles as like the Jordan 3s if I want to repaint them. Use this, get the paint off easily. Just want to show you guys. On to the next. Next, I have painter's tape. Just regular blue tape. So when I paint, it doesn't leak on the outsole, midsole, suede, anything. Just put this where you need to and start painting. Yeah, that's painter's tape. We have the suede and new bug kit. Just wanted to get this. Inside you have the eraser for the new book and the brush. This is like eight dollars. Just want to get it for my infrareds, just for like scuffs and stuff. Next up, we have acetone. Got this from Home Depot. It was like six dollars. Using it for restoration projects. Just easily get paint off. Not really a hassle. There you go. I have the sticker right here. You guys want to check them out? There's a phone number, Twitter, Facebook. Instagram. There you go. First thing, Angelus Sway die. Had to get this for my Heat Got Game 13s. I am working on a restoration project. I am recording it if you guys want to know. So, this is my first restoration. So, need this for the black suede. I will put a video up. I just don't know when. Hopefully by the end of June, the restoration video will be up. have Air Legend Cleaner. I did get this from Roots also. This is one of the best cleaners I ever used. Haven't tried Jason Merck yet, but I will in the future. But right now, this is the best cleaner I use. Next again, we have the Angelus Matte Finisher for the paint. I am restoring Higa Game 13s, as I said before. Just want to show you guys what it looks like. There you go, AngelusDirect.com. We'll put the link in the description. Best products on the market. One more Angelus thing, the white paint for the He Got Game 13's restoration project. Just want to show you guys, got this from Roots. I will put the link in the description for AngelusDirect.com. One of the best products on the market. There you guys go. Last but not least, we do have some paint brushes. They get this from Roots also, from Real Value. Don't know where exactly exactly to get these from, but I'm sure any arts and craft store will have these. Just regular paint brushes. There you go. Okay, guys. So that is it for the recent pickup videos, and I'll see you soon. Thanks for checking it out. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, everything down in the description. I will put the links for AndrewsDirect.com down below if you guys want to check them out. And thanks for watching.